Hi everybody. Well, today was an extra long day of plasmapheresis, and to make a very long story short, um, the plasmapheresis machine started beeping like crazy, and they removed plasma out of my heart via my vas calf. I don't know if you guys can see it. My neck. See this line right here? Well, it leads down to there. And that's as far as I'm going to go. But it takes blood out of there, out of these two hookups, and um, gives me my blood back without plasma. But when the machine started beeping, she opened it up, and I wasn't getting my blood back. I had, there's blood everywhere. I had lost a ton of blood and I'm already anemic. I've had blood transfusions before. So they're going to do some tests to see where to go from here. Um, the, I don't know, I don't really know how to put this. I want research done on plasmapheresis and autonomic failure or the autonomic system like dysautonomia and POTS. I want research done for plasmapheresis and that and I want it to go beyond I want to make a difference beyond YouTube beyond contacting newspapers and beyond contacting um, news channels so what I'm going to try to do is find out who is researching dysautonomia or POTS, autonomic failure, find out who is doing their best to try and, you know, learn about it, and maybe write them and tell them of my symptoms that have been residing with plasmapheresis and autonomic failure, and see if they can do some trials there. Um, I believe that doing some trials in plasmapheresis and the autonomic system would help open a lot of doors because the deal is with your plasma you have antibodies in your plasma and in my case I have antibodies in my plasma that attack my autonomic system so when they remove the plasma the symptoms reside and go away and can even be cured. So I'm going to do my best to try and write, write as many people who are researching the autonomic system, POTS, dysautonomia, write them, tell them of how plasmapheresis has helped me and ask them if they would be interested in doing some trials if we can get the funding. Um, I think that would be the hardest is to find funding for that. Um, I may even record a DVD and send it to them instead of writing so that way they can see me in person and see how plasmapheresis has helped me and um, send it to them that way asking them to do research. You never know, some people may just throw it in the trash but other people really do care and they, li they just might listen. And if I can get research going on that, that would be amazing. And I want to go beyond. I want to make a difference. And I want to do my best to help find a cure for this before anybody else has to suffer from it. So, if you guys know of anybody who is re currently researching POTS, dysautonomia, or autonomic failure, let me know who and where they are and I will try and contact them if they are outside of the United States it doesn't matter I will try and contact them too I want to make this is I just want to make a difference and I'm really hoping that this will come together I don't know how many letters I'll end up writing but it should be interesting because I don't think anybody's done trials with plasmapheresis and the autonomic system like POTS and dysautonomia. This video I feel like I'm just rambling on and on. Um, I don't really have anything else to talk about. I'm just exhausted. And uh, 
I hope this video wasn't boring for you because it feels boring to me and uh, I, I'll try to make my next video more interesting. So I'll talk to you guys later.